So, a satisfied conscience. Meet with Paladin Romania Fort Atlas. Sounds like a plan to me. It kind of sounds like we're getting close to the end, doesn't it? It's not a very long DLC, seems like. Okay. So, she looks like she's on top. Agree, this isn't something we can ignore. Between what we learned at AMS and the journal we recovered from Harper's Ferry, this is big. If this is the source of a super mutant threat, I'm prepared to support any action to end it. Initiate. Good timing. Of course. I can't believe he just walked in here. He must have been at work even then. What? Uh We couldn't have known. It's not your fault. <clears throat> I never said it was my fault, Initiate. To think. The arrogance he must have had. Enough of that. The question facing us now is how to find him and the people who've been taken. Lucky for us, Scribe Valdez has made a discovery of her own while we were away. That's right. Remember the pit boy you found in the uncanny caverns? Mm -hmm. It took a while to crack the encryption, but I've unlocked it. It came from Bolt 96. Okay. Uh, where's that? It took a bit of research to locate <clears throat> it, but it's well south of here. I'll mark it on your map. How is this related to the abductions? Well, we're not sure it is. What we do know is that we have a definitive lead to follow. The super mutant threat takes priority. If we find the missing civilians in the process, so much the better. But we cannot ignore this lead either way. Unsurprisingly, Night Shin and I don't see eye to eye on this. Fortunately, in this case, we don't have to. I think they're connected. A vault would be a great place to hide abductees. The Pip Boy might even have come from someone that escaped. Investigating the vault is our best lead for either mystery, and maybe an answer to both. Possibly. And we're agreed. The vault will be your next target. Scribe Valdez will accompany you. A vault. Oh, cool. A potential trove of exactly the kind of technology the Brotherhood is meant to catalog and secure. I've marked Vault 96 on your map. We don't know what we're walking into or even how we'll get in, to be honest. We'll need to be cautious. Uh. So what's the plan? Step one is finding a way in. You'll take point. Based on other vaults we found crossing the country, the vault should have an emergency transponder. Once you've secured the entrance, the controls for the transponder are usually there near the main door. Activate it to give the all clear and I'll follow you in. Okay. Are we sure about this? There's no guarantees, but we have to move on this intel. It's a good plan, and I think we're all in agreement on this one. Find any evidence you can about the missing people and any connection to the super mutants. If Blackburn is there, I want him taken alive. If he really is behind the abductions, he needs to answer for his crimes. You have your orders, Initiate. Good luck. Dismissed. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so we are off to Vault 96. She said way south from here. Yeah, it's very far. We've discovered it before though, apparently. So we can fast travel straight there. That's the good thing. So let's see what well, Vault 96 secrets are in store for us. Saves us a lot of time being able to just fast travel straight there, huh? Honestly, I don't remember ever discovering it, to be honest, but at least with this character. Go to Vault 96. Well, lo and behold, we are already here. Okay. There should be stairs right here that we can take up and around. It's really dark, isn't it? Oh, the door's open. <clears throat> this should definitely be interesting for sure. I wonder what we're going to find in here. 
Hopefully nothing too disturbing. Welcome home. I don't think I want to make this home. This looks like a cave in here. How does this look like a cave? Wait a minute. We got some Hellcats. I'll be taking that. Thank you very much. But why are they dead? Someone's still alive. Woods. A little late to the party, aren't you? Sure looking to loot the place. Some blood eagles are ahead of you in line. I'd stop you, but... Uh, I think I quit. <laughs> uh, what happened here? Our squad was guarding the entrance here when we were overrun by blood eagles. It killed everyone. <laughs> uh, me too. I just haven't kicked it yet. Who are you? Name's Woods. Corporal Woods, Hellcat Company. Mercenaries. We got hired by this creep of a doctor to guard the place. Among other things. Promised us salvage rights here when he was done. <laughs> and I don't think we're gonna collect on that. Ah, uh, blood eagles? Yeah. Raider types, but more bloodthirsty. You know? You can usually deal with the crater sort. Blood eagles, though. <laughs> they enjoy the killing. Uh... I need to know more. Hell of a bedside manner <laughs> you've got. You know I'm dying, right? <sighs> Go ahead. It's not like I'm doing anything else. Clock's ticking, though. Why'd you- uh, none of that is relevant. Alright, screw it. There must be something I could do to help you. That's kind, but it's a little late for that. I've seen enough gut shots in my time to know a stim pack and bandages aren't gonna fix this. This one's got my name on it. God knows I've done enough to deserve it. Damn. Well, sorry, Woods. Let's go inside and find out what's going on here. Access denied? Rude. Nope. Okay. Made it up. No problem. Uh... I'm just gonna click through this because I don't know what the right one is. And I don't want to read all of this because that's a lot of reading. And I'm not the best reader in the world. You guys could always push pause uh, if you guys want to read any of this. There's a lot of reading. We would have literally been here for an hour with my reading skill level <laughs> okay activate emergency emergency transponder I guess that would have been the smart one to choose huh speak describe Valdez hey how did you get here so quick it's freezing in here look at all this ice environmental controls must be damaged what happened here those are Hellcat company uniforms right it looks like a massacre I know so let's am I hungry again Blo blood eagles got here before we did uh, wiped out uh, the mercs wiped the mercs out the blood legal uh, the the blood eagles are still inside yeah one survivor but I couldn't save her she said they were working for Blackburn then the blood eagles arrived and overrun overran them blood eagles what are they doing here? Looks like Paladin Romani was right. There's a link between the abductions, Blackburn, and the super mutants. We still need to figure out what. 
Give me a moment to look at these terminals. The super mutants are clearly the experiment. Blackburn's experiment. That's not good. The vault's on internal lockdown. I guess someone's responding to the Blood Eagle attack. If there are automated defenses still working, they'll all be active. We may be facing more than just Blood Eagles. Be careful. Let's get moving. I'll follow your lead. Okay. Let's play this while we go in there. Personal log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn. Return to Appalachia. After all these years, I have come back. Back to Appalachia. To West Virginia. To the home of my greatest personal and scientific failure. Academic research was a dead end. The world was descending into riots and ruin. Food shortages were increasing. Generating papers in a university lab to attempt to secure tenure seemed pointless. It felt irresponsible in the face of everything happening. West Tech approached me about joining the Greenhouse Initiative. Genetic engineering to produce new crops and multiply production. It swept away my concerns about joining the private sector. Here was a chance to be on the cutting edge and solve real problems at the same time. Dr. Dumont described the goals of the Pan Immunity Theory and the Greenhouse Initiative in terms that set my mind ablaze. There was satisfaction to be had there, doing the best work, advancing humanity, making the world better than it was. Then the funding vanished, the research staff was being cut with no explanation, simply a shift in priorities. Dumont begged me to stay, promising the new work would be vital challenging to my everlasting shame I did and long that was a long one but we learned a lot out of that absolutely right mrs. blood eagle there's one over there let's go wipe this guy out so the mercenaries aren't bad then. I thought they were involved in a worse way. But, to be honest, they're just, they were just hired. They're just doing their job, you know? Sniping with a scatter shot laser rifle. Not gonna lie, that was pretty impressive. Hopefully a lot of these people have Laser weapon, so that plasma plasma weapons work too. Okay, because I could use laser weapon or uh, ammo. All right. Looks like there's a couple on this side. Wait, let me check that guy. I'm over encumbered officially. I need a workbench. You're done, so. Come here. It wow. Seems I have an excess of visitors today. Ah, yes. The one I met at Fort Atlas. I did hope we would meet again under more convivial circumstances. These are not they, unfortunately. I have no quarrel with the Brotherhood. But I must ask you to leave immediately. Please leave me be. I cannot be responsible for what may happen if you remain. I don't think I, I will. Think we found Dr. Blackburn. Looks like most of this place is locked off. We need to search everywhere, but our options are limited right now. I think that door labeled mainframe is stuck open, though. Let's start there. Okay, well, we are back encumbered. So that's good. And all the people... What is going on over there? Search the main... This vault was a biological research What is going on? Perhaps it is fitting that I found this place. I have been honest about my purpose. Whoa. She has a flamer. Okay. 
Hold on. Let's, uh, let's kill everyone. Oh, the, oh no. Let's play this while we take out some enemies. Okay. Timestamp. You guys can push pause if you guys want to read any of these. All right. Be careful. Dunzo. Is there a turret around here? Sounds like it. Definitely is. Downstairs. Hello. Goodbye. So that was all of them. We're good now. Well, that's not fun. How do I get in there? Short circuit the terminal. Which terminal? This one, maybe? No. Still alive. How am I still alive? Don't worry, Mr. Blood Eagle. You're not gonna be alive much longer, I promise. Uh-oh. Got him. All right, there's got to be a way in there, man, but I don't know how. <laughs> oh, never mind. We're already on the other side. That's the terminal. I'll be taking that. Dunzo. <laughs> that guy had a shotgun. Short circuit. That was easy. Gotta be careful. Your persistent refusal to depart is a distraction I do not need. Please, I am asking you again. Leave this place and do not return. There is nothing for you here but sorrow. Whatever you think you will come. Oh no. I promise you that you not. Come on, buddy. I like that a lot of them have the ammo I use. Oh god. Toodles. Oh snap! Where'd you come from? Got him. There's still more of them. Just not entirely sure where. Let's play this while we take them out. Capable of success. These moments 
Oh. Uh. Uh, yeah, it's me, Basher. Wow. You're an even worse liar than I am. Wait. That voice. I know who you are. Tally Lang? Is that the girl that was trying to get the... The weapons? Oh, you're the one I talked to back at Fort Atlas. It is. You know her? Oh, we're in bad shape here. The door slammed shut and cut us off from the rest of the gang. We've got robots attacking every few minutes. We need help. I thought you were a poor, hopeless orphan. Why are you helping a bunch of blood eagles? Hardy har har. Let's get serious and make it quick. It's because she was lying, that's why. You, and you can help me. What kind of help are we talking about? I've been trying to get us out of here since we've been locked in. I just found this vault security key card. It should open all the doors in this place. <laughs> you help us? It's yours. What do you think, Valdez? Valdez? You got someone else out there? <laughs> Should I be jealous? Yes. I don't think we've got much choice. We're going to need that key card to bypass the rest of the security doors. Yeah, I agree. <sighs> Why didn't you just escape? I told you I just found it, dummy. I was about to try it out right when I heard you walk up. Mm. What's to stop you shooting us uh, as soon as the door opens? I saw what you did to those mercenaries. Nothing. Same as stopping you from shooting us if we let you in. We don't need more Good point. trouble. We just want to get out of here. Help us hold off the bots and we'll leave peacefully. For you, anyway. No promises if someone else tries to stop us. Alright, deal. Now we're talking. Now give me a sec to get the door open. Good thing Shin's not here. I don't think he'd agree to this. <laughs> me either. I kind of want to kill Tally Lane. One down. Don't worry, guys. You guys are safe. I see another one over here. Oh, I thought that was... I thought that was it. Oh, I didn't realize my health was so low. Oops. I guess I should probably, uh... Pay more attention to that, huh? Man, I'm all the way at the beginning of the vault. Also, why did my perspective change? That's weird. I gotta find my way all the way over there now. That sucks. I'll get there eventually. Okay, we went left from here, I believe. Can I just come in here? Was it this way? Honestly, I don't know where we're going. Alright, we are definitely on the right track. Okay. We're almost there. I know that, as a fact. Um... Actually, we did go this way, didn't we? Wait, what? Oh, the... No, 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 don't, don't die. The mercenaries were behind us the whole time. Oh, God. I hate robots. Come on. Oh, 
Get out of the way, Tally Lang. Oh, snap. Oh, no. Run. Okay, good. Let's push forward a little bit. While we have the opportunity to. Dude, it's it's a robot invasion. Look at this dude with the minigun. How about you put in some work? Is that it? It is. Tally Lay, talk to me. I swear I thought her name was something else. Picture another D in there. Ain't scared of you, punk. Tally, talk to me. Oh my god, this is horrible. There it goes. Damn. Good thing you showed up when you did. Looks like I was right about you. Shame we keep meeting under these circumstances. We could get into some real trouble. Not gonna happen. The Brotherhood bailed us out. Well, a deal's a deal. Key card's yours. <laughs> Actually, I think we've got a few blood eagles to put down. I want to do this, but it's not the honorable thing to do. Alright. All yours. You got this far, so I'm guessing the way you came is clear. Thanks again. Maybe we won't even shoot you if we see you again. Just give me a reason, no promises. Asshole. I mean, you could try. You've got interesting friends, Initiate. She's definitely not my friend. Definitely not my friend. Okay. So something is down here. Oh. More stuff to listen to. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn, number 57. I begin to doubt my own sanity at times. My efforts, while not without progress, continue to fail to bear real fruit. The FEV seems almost deliberately malignant. As if it had a consciousness and rejects my every attempt to bend it toward a benevolent end. Hmm. I've come to recognize the signs of imminent metastasis. These vessels were once conversion to the so called soft mutant state. I am ill equipped to deal with the product of such failure. Like when they have taken to disposing of these themselves always outside the vault itself. I regret that my current methods of disposal may, in the short term, increase the super mutant population. I have turned what they left behind. I cannot be a friend. And long. I regret the ugliness you Okay, well, another one to listen to. The things I had to <coughs> research long, Dr. Edgar Blackstone. But that was a pleasant My work's demand for human subjects has increased dramatically. As I imagine it was my death to kill me. To this end, I have contracted with a group of mercenaries calling themselves the Hellcat Company. Trustworthy. They are used for moral flexibility. They do not question the nature of my work or my need for human subjects. And I do not eliminate them. Already they have begun acquiring new subjects at a far greater pace than I could, and a contingent remain to guard the vault itself. I must be careful. A mercenary is only as loyal as their name, after all. I control the vault security systems, keeps them in check. For now. And oh! I'm on fire! Those hollow tapes are really, really long, aren't they? A lot of good information, but it's just they're just really long. So it's like a double-edged sword almost. Research terminal. Do I want to read all this? No, but you guys can. That sounds disgusting. What is that? K144H. Well, figured it out. Eject that hollow tape. Serum trials. I already did that. Personal logs. Test chambers. Okay. Hopefully I don't get attacked. Feel free to push pause if you guys want to read any of this. 
Okay. We're golden. Let's go help out Valdez. <coughs> Whoops. Oh, it's a Snallygaster. Oh yeah, I guess it makes sense. That really didn't kill you? There we go. Alright, so look at the prisoners. That's horrible. Uh You're not with those others, are you? No. Can you get us out of here? She's clearly a settler. Oh, that's Cassie, right? Callaway or whatever? Uh, who are you? Cassie. Cassie Alloway. L listen, I ain't trying to be rude. I'll tell you my whole dang life story if you want. Just get me out of here first. I feel sick. Is everyone alright in there? Pretty good, actually. Uh, do you know how to open up the cell? Uh, not exactly. I think the locks are controlled remotely. The doctor guy always does something back behind the stairs there before he comes back to grab one of us for his test. Somebody get it. All right, sit tight. I'll get you out of there. Okay. I was gonna go for a walk, but I guess I'll stay here for now. Sorry. Seriously, though. Thank you. No worries. Back. Over here. Yeah, I can understand how she doesn't know. This is kind of far and out of the way. Well, first of all, let me eject that. Okay, that's the first one. Second. It's a lot. Clearly that's not it. Test chamber access. There it is. Uh, seal unlock. Well, I guess I gotta do this individually. Three, open. Four. Did I not open three? Okay, so there's a problem with three. Okay, I suppose we'll listen to that. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn. Number 13. Whatever the prior occupants of this vault may have done, I must thank them. Especially Chief Engineer Dr. Memling. The good doctor, while a respectable scientist in his own right, had the classic engineer's idiosyncratic approach to maintenance. His additions to the vault reactor and electrical subsystems provide me with ample points of connection directly access Bane's power. Between this and certain defects in reactor shielding, I have invaluable resources for my research. My first attempts in this area are more disappointing, however. Lacking Memling's expertise, my electrical impedance tests <coughs> failed dramatically. The unintentional discovery of a new method of rapidly cooking a mole rat fails even in that regard. Mole rat exposed to several thousand volts at significant amperage does not make for an appetizing sight. Nonetheless, these results are duly recorded, and I believe my understanding of the system is sufficient to produce more useful results in the future. And long. Okay. Oh, thank God. You've got my thanks, stranger. Introductions are in order, I guess. My name's Cassie. Did I say that already? Hmm? Are you hurt? I'm not injured. Got lucky. The doc didn't do any surgery on me. That nut job was dosing me with diseases, though. Said he was testing incubation and immune response time. <laughs> Weird thing is, he kept apologizing. Bad case of sludge lung now. <clears throat> but I'm, I'm holding up. <clears throat> Some of the others are in worse shape. Well, at least you're good. Here, take this. For real? Must be my guardian angel. That's awesome. Oh, well, I did get kidnapped and locked up by a mad scientist, so maybe not. But still, thank you. You get to miss and breathe them normally. Glad you're doing better. Uh. I can't take it anymore. Can you make it out of here? Maybe I could, but <laughs> there's no way the rest will. I don't even know where we are, but <clears throat> I'm guessing we're not close to civilization. These folks won't make it a mile in their condition. 
It's better if they stay here. When we've cleared the vault, I'll radio Fort Atlas. They can send the medics with the recovery team and get them to safety. Whatever Fort Atlas is, that sounds good to me. Thanks, kindly. Yeah, this I'll makes sense. I'll water for you to share until help arrives. You're a peach. Uh, are there any more prisoners? I think we're the last surviving ones. Damn. There used to be more. When he takes you out of the cells, you don't always come back. Hasn't been down here in a few days, though. Figured he got what he wanted, or someone done him in. Good timing on your part. The crappy rations he gave us last time are nearly gone. Okay. Uh, well. Alright, Cassie. All of you sit tight. Help is on the way soon. We ain't going anywhere. <laughs> hey, if you run into that crazy doctor, give him a kick for me. Alright? Absolutely. Speak. Oh, wait. Open the overseer's office. What's in the overseer's office, I wonder? Haha, -ha, I got the key. But wow, we gotta go through multiple doors to get to the overseer's office. Oh, this is this is back at the entrance. We came in from that side, I believe. Ha ha! Though it seems futile, I ask one final time. Leave this vault and the things you have seen. You cannot change what has happened here. Leave me to this cold and lonely place. Nope. The card doesn't work? Blackburn must have overridden the door codes. Probably guess the looters might find a key card eventually if they had the run of the place. Can you do anything about that? From here? If I had more tools, time, and some schematics, sure. Under the circumstances, we'll have to get creative. These doors are hydraulically <clears throat> sealed. Shut down the hydraulics. If we find the lines that feed to this door, we might be able to cut the pressure holding it shut. Look for a utility room nearby. Will do. Utility room. Haha. -ha. It's on the far side. Let me in. I got some valves to shut. So this panel connects uh, to an array of pipes that appear to control the hydraulic lines within the vault. You can see which line connects to the overseer's door, but you still need to figure out how to disable it. Intelligence. Identify and close the correct valve. Uh, blade weapon. Uh, cut the hydraulic line uh, to the door. Smash the controls and hope. Leave. I don't have a bladed weapon. But let's try this anyways. That'll drop the pressure, all right? Okay. The door should be open. The hydraulic lines are no match for your blade. And quick chop sends a gush of hydraulic fluid bursting forth, immediately lowering the pressure. Leave. Let's go. So that should give us access to that door now. It should be open, just period. Perfect. Maybe not like that. It probably would stay down, but it wouldn't have any pressure keeping it closed, so we should be able to open it. it oh my god. The vault defenses, nor the Blood Eagles were a match for you. Quite formidable. You can lower your weapons. It would clearly be futile for me to struggle, and I surrender willingly. We're taking you in, Blackburn. You have to pay for what you've done here. Yes, I assumed as much when you entered. Very well. Consider me arrested, if you must. I am ready to face any judgment the Brotherhood wishes to mete out. My work here is complete, regardless. And it is too late for you to stop it. What does that mean? Your work cannot be stopped? What do you mean? Simply that I have achieved my goal. The FEV is perfected, and it is too late for you to change that. My sacrifices, the terrible things I have done to accomplish this, it has been paid in full. 
And now salvation awaits humanity. Not if I could stop it. You can't do anything with it now. We've caught you. You're finished. Have I given you any reason to believe I have not already taken the necessary action? Okay, that's not good. <laughs> that reaction was funny. Okay, let me see. <laughs> uh, what have you done with the FEV? I have completed it. I turned the flawed miscreation into something that will heal an ill and wounded humanity. But if by that you mean, what have I done with the result? It is no longer here. I have associates. They are even now finalizing the mechanisms of its distribution. You are too late. Paladin Romani needs to hear about this immediately. Agreed. We didn't know about that, so... I think we're done here. I am at your disposal, then. Clearly. You can head out. I'll radio for a team to secure the site and get the prisoners to safety. Then bring Blackburn back to the fort. I'm sure the others are going to have a lot of questions for him. Good work, Initiate. I'm glad you were here. Thank you. So, he said he perfected the FEV. So, what is that? Like a super, super mutant? Like a perfected super mutant? What did we get? We're over encumbered now. Blackburn's bungalow? How over encumbered am I? Pretty, actually. Uh. First of all, those can go away. I have a ton of stuff. I want to keep those outfits because I think they're... They could be unique, perhaps. I don't know. I don't know what I want to drop. Well, we could definitely drink some water. Okay, we're getting closer. Well, that can go away. Um, some aid. A dick doll. Okay, we should be good. Started the catalyst. So this is... Back at the Brotherhood of Steel Play, so let's go. 